This is section nine, number eight. The triangle ABC here has the following vertex, uh, the triangle ABC and its image after this guided reflection. The guided reflection is a composite transformation that has a translation followed by the reflection. All right, so I'm going to first use word because I can graph very easily here. So A is at one comma three, right? One comma three is right there. Then B is at negative two, negative one. And three is at, C is at three, comma negative two, which is right here. I can now connect it, okay? So this is the original point, the original triangle. I'm gonna also grab that and put it right here as well because both A and B have the same image, okay? So first of all, I'm going to apply this translation. That translation means uh, two units to the right and zero units up. Okay, that's what it means. All right, so, and I'm gonna make that in red. So, I'm going to grab this one, but make it red, and I'm going to apply that transformation of two units to the right. One, two. There you go. Now it says to reflect it. So reflect it, okay? I just have to draw a line of reflection. So here is my line of reflection is on the Y axis. I'm gonna, I should just make that a line, okay? Now make this line green, okay? So we can see it. And now it's going to, this red is now going to be reflected. Okay. So it's here. Now it's going to be reflected. So I'm going to rotate and reflect it. Uh, I'm going to reflect it horizontally and it should be at the same. Yeah. Okay. It should be right here. All right. And I'm going to make that the color uh, purple. Okay. So this is the reflection in the y-axis, okay? And that is gonna be purple, all right? All right, so it started with the original blue, okay? I'm gonna delete that. Then it went to the red, then it went to a purple, okay? That's how the, the new transformation looks like. I'm gonna have all three here so you can see it, okay? The next one, and this one is uh, a translation of negative one comma one in its vector. So it's one unit left and one unit up. Then lastly, it's gonna be same, a reflection over the Y axis, okay? So let's grab this, paste, Make it red to indicate that we're going to do the translation. All right, so here's the original. I'm just gonna move one unit left, then one unit up. Okay, there you go. Now I'm gonna reflect it. So here, let me draw my line of reflection. And that is that green line that is very large that tells us we're gonna reflect across that. Grab that, make it purple, okay? And I'm gonna hit the rotate button here horizontally, and then it's gonna reflect it right. All right, is that, hold on. Perfect, good. All right. Okay, so let's see. Purple, delete, purple, then red. So this is the original. Then we went two units, one unit left, one unit up, so that is red. Then we reflect it, which is that, okay? So this purple is how it looks like after the translation and the reflection, okay? I'm gonna have all three up so you can see it. All right, so. There you go.